What's up, YouTube? Got another lunch special for you here today. Got something I've never tried before. Used to work there. Used to be a manager there. Worked there for quite a while. That's right, folks. We are talking about the DQ. What I have today is a one half pound flamethrower burger. And of course, if it ain't flamey, I got a brand new bottle to make it flamey. Anyway, I ordered it as is, didn't change nothing. Uh, we've got lettuce, tomato, bacon, half pound burger it says. Kind of falling apart here. I uh, see some cheese. Looks like white cheese. It does have uh, lots of sauce. Flamethrower sauce, I guess. So, uh, I'm going to try it here. Nibble on some of the lettuce. I don't know. It looks pretty tasty. What do you think? Looks like a, kind of like a mess. <laughs> All right, here goes, folks. I like the flavor. Not a lot of cheese. It's good. I don't have much heat yet. You can't beat a bacon cheeseburger. I mean, I like the bun. Not that sesame seed stuff. I like the bacon. Bacon's got a good flavor. I can taste the bacon through the burger, so that's a plus. Speaking of bacon, some fell out. We'll have none of that. Flamethrowy? Yeah. Like most stuff, I'm not getting any discernible heat from it yet. It's a good burger. I'd eat it again. It's a little expensive, but it's like six dollars or something, I think. Six seventy nine. Can't remember. I got a receipt here or not. Uh, the combo was like eight eight or nine bucks. Eight it was eight fifty nine or something. I don't have a receipt. But yeah, it is right here. Flamethrower burger with tax. Six dollars and forty six cents. So it's not really a deal. But I mean it is a big burger. I'm sure it'll fill, <laughs> fill pretty much anybody up. Uh, yeah, I didn't get the combo. It's just too much. Too much money, too much food. Alright. Absolutely no heat from it, but it's good. I'm not sure what all they put on this. But bacon cheese. I don't know. I don't know what kind of sauce it's supposed to be, but it doesn't taste good, but I may have eh, a little slight tingle on the tongue a little bit, I guess. The more I eat, I guess, the more it, it's not hot, but it might be spicy to somebody that doesn't eat hot stuff, but if you're like me, you ain't gonna get no heat from it. But it's a good burger. I'd buy it again. For sure. I mean, hey, what's, it is what it is. It's fast food. Alright, well, there you have it. Try one out. Drop me a comment down in there if you uh, if you tried one. Uh, uh, yeah, I used to work there years and years ago. Back in my late teens, early 20s. I think I'm going to make it flamethrower. It's tasty. <laughs> there we go. That ought to do it. Alright. Yeah, it's a good burger. I'm not going to give that a thumbs down. Might give the price a thumbs down, but we'll try it now. 
Yeah, that's got some heat. I can get that local. It's a hot, ghost pepper hot sauce. 480,000 Scoville, it says. I kind of go through it. Uh, it's kind of just one of my grab and go sauces. It's not real expensive, like three something, four bucks. And it's hot. Keeps my tolerance built up. Alright, folks. Been another lunch on the go. Click that like, subscribe. Check out more reviews and hot challenges and fishing videos. I'm getting a little late in the year for that. But I spent most of my time working on the boats this year. But we'll get some more of them up. As always, keep it spicy. Try that burger. I'll give it a... Yeah, I'll give it 7 out of 10 stars. It's pretty good. For fast food. I'm not saying 7 out of 10 stars for gourmet. <laughs> 7 out of 10 for a fast food burger. Alright. I'm going to doctor it up. Put some more hot sauce on it. I'll see y'all later, folks. Captain's Redneck, shining out.